coming up on the next All New 24 News. Hello everyone, I'm Marcus Sewer coming up on 24 News. An overnight brush fire kept emergency crews in Middletown busy for several hours. Boris Yeltsin, who played a key role in the Soviet Union government, became Russia's first president and he has died at the age of 76. We'll have your forecast to see if this warm weather will be sticking around. 24 News webcast starts right now. <laughs> I'm Marcus Roon. Today is April 24th, 2007. An overnight brush fire kept emergency crews in Middletown busy for several hours. Police say the fire burned 10 to 15 acres at the in intersection of Ryefield and River Roads. There's no word yet on what caused that fire. Boris Yeltsin, who played a key role in the Soviet Union's government, became Russia's first president and he's died at the age of 76. Mr. Yeltsin, who had a history of heart trouble, died with heart failure at the hospital at 345. He came to power after being promoted by the former Soviet leader, a man who then he outmaneuvered. He was noted as a defender of democracy when in 1991 he mounted a tank in Moscow. In what became one of the defying moments of his career, Mr. Yeltsin rallied the people against an attempt to overthrow the government. Two years later, he ordered Russian tanks to fire on their own parliament in October 1993, when the building was occupied by political opponents. In other news, a Bridgeport man has been arrested after he tried to trade in a jeep to a car dealer a month after he allegedly stole the same jeep from the same dealer. Jerhel King 29 was arrested Saturday after a sales manager at Wholesalers America recognized King's 2003 Black Jeep Liberty as a vehicle that was reported stolen from his lot early in March. Now in weather, take a look at the forecast. Tuesday, today it would be sunny, 76, and then getting cloudier as the week goes on into the weekend. It doesn't look too good. 55 on Friday, 64 on Saturday. In mid-60s for the remaining part of this week, this weather won't be sticking around, but we will get the spring weather back soon. That's all news for tonight. Visit abc24news.net for more news. I'm Marcus Haroon, 24 News. Have a great day, everyone.